Hey, Tiger fans, Mark Fitzpatrick from Tiger Club of Kansas City. October 2nd is the date, and our speaker today is new Mizzou baseball coach Carrick Jackson. Coach, you absolutely captivated the crowd today. Welcome back. You were an assistant here for five years in the early 2010s, and it's great to have you back. No, I appreciate you guys having me out. Uh, so I want to ask you, first of all, when you took over the team, you had a number of kids enter the transfer portal yes. after the uh, Coach Beasley was let go. You had to work pretty hard, and you kept most of them. Yeah, we did. We did a good job of being able to reach out to those guys and just explain our vision to them and, and reaffirm the reasons why they chose this institution and what this school means to them. And that was, I think, what kept most of them here was they love the place, they love what the program was about, and they know that we're going in the right direction. How hard is it when you come in uh, in the spring? You have not been able to recruit in the fall. How hard is it to assemble a recruiting class at that point? It's tough, especially with as fast as recruiting goes now. They changed some rules, but you have guys that were freshmen and sophomores in high school that have been committed to places for a long time. So being able to come in here, kind of get, get our feet on the ground, understand first and foremost what we need, being able to assess that and then going out and trying to still get some guys. And this year we're able to put together what I think is going to be a pretty solid recruiting class. But as we're moving forward and getting more time to evaluate what we have, we're going to be in a much better position. Talk about some of your key guys coming back. I know second baseman Trevor Austin uh, is a spine player. How about some other guys? Yeah, you got Trevor Austin. Um, you got Javen Pimentel, left-handed pitcher, who's a weekend guy for him at the end. Ended up with a little shoulder thing, got banged up, but he finished the year strong. Logan Lunsford. Uh, Jackson Lovich, who's right from here in Kansas City. Um, so some of those guys, are, we're really looking forward to them being able to step up to do some pretty good things. You uh, turned it around quickly at Southern. We coached there. You turned it around very quick in your year at Memphis. Uh, you're coming. There is no question <laughs> this is the toughest conference in the country. It's going to get a lot better with Oklahoma and Texas coming yes. too, but I know you're up for the challenge. Oh, no doubt. I think the thing for us here for sure is the culture. We got to have our guys, they have to be in the right place mentally and understand that again, let's not get caught up into what everybody else does. Let's concentrate on what we do. Let's go out and play good, clean baseball and then see what happens at the end of the day. You've assembled a very solid coaching staff, but a guy I want to talk to you about who's come up here and talked to us many times past New Hope, Mizzou Hall of Famer, Tim Jamison. Great to have him back here as your pitching coach. Uh, outstanding. I mean, he's one of my biggest mentors. Um, I'm not where I am today if it's not for him. And so for him to be willing to come back and, and go this, walk this journey with me, I couldn't ask for anything better. He's uh, got quite a resume. Last thing I want to ask you, you know, you're, uh, you were very uh, uh, forthcoming today about your coaching philosophy and working with kids and you expect them to excel in all areas of their life. Talk a little about that. that that's the basis of everything, right? We, when you're in the SEC, you want to assume that everybody's going off to play professional baseball, but the reality of it is, is they're not. Right. And even if they do, we want to have them prepare for that. But we got to remind them that at the end of the day, you're going to be a productive member of our society. You're going to be a father. You're going to have a chance to be a husband. So we have to make sure that we do everything in our power to impact them in the most positive way to make sure that they have holistic success. And if it happens on the baseball field, great. If it doesn't, then we need to make sure that it happens in their life regardless. What's your first uh, spring trip for this year? Uh, we Stay go out to season. California. We go Cal Poly. Okay. And All we'll right. be out Cal Poly, uh, San Luis Obispo for the first weekend, and then go down to San Diego State and play in the Tony Gwynn uh, Classic right. the second And the home opener in March, right? And the home opener nice, in March. Nice and warm. It's there you fair. go. All right, Carrick Jackson, new baseball coach. Folks, we're in good hands with this guy as our coach. Hey, next week here at the Tiger Club, we will have the longtime voice of the Tigers, member of the Missouri Sports Hall of Fame, Mike Kelly. So play, make sure you're here. For more information on our speakers and our membership, go to kctigerclub.com.